From the world headquarters of Holy Mackerel Productions at the lovely Swamp Water Lounge, Winery, and Health Spa, this is the Main Event Radio Show. The Main Event, it's original, homegrown, and good for you. And always features great entertainment from our own backyard. Hi, Dan Foley here. Good to have your company as we cruise the entertainment highways and byways of the Pine Tree State and beyond. So let's get this show on the road, shall we? Here it comes, down that electronic highway, this edition of the Main Event Radio Show. Come on, two, three, four. He was stranded in the tiny town on Fair Prince Edward Isle, waiting for a ship to come and find him. A one-horse place, a friendly face, and coffee in the tiny trace, a fiddling in the distance far behind him. A dime across the counter then A shy hello, a brand new friend A walk along the street in the wintry wind A yellow light, an open door And a welcome friend, there's room for more And then they're standing there inside together They said I've heard that tune before somewhere But I can't remember when Was it on some other friendly shore? Did I hear it on the wind? Was it written on the sky above? I think I heard it from someone I love But I've never heard her sound so sweet since then A little boy says, I'll take your hat, and he's caught up in the magic of her smile. A leap the heart inside him went, and off across the floor he sent his clumsy body, graceful as a child. He said, there's magic in the fiddler's arm, there's magic in this town. There's magic in the dancer's feet and the way they put them down. People smiling everywhere, boots and ribbons, locks of hair, laughter and old blue suits and Easter gowns. Sailor's gone, the room is bare The old piano's sitting there Someone's hat slipped hanging on the rack Empty chairs, the wooden floor That feels the touch of shoes no more Waiting for the dancers to come back And the fiddle's in the closet Of some daughter of the town The strings are broke, the bow's gone And the cover's buttoned down Sometimes on December nights when the air is cold and the wind is right There's a melody that passes through the town Been on the road a 
too long I've been on the road for ten days Baby, I'm coming back home stuff is good for you. Get yours right here. The main event.
vessels at sea on the moonless night. But just how long will the light stay on when the dark is all that we know? It's all that we know. It's all we never know. We get murdered by the plans we made. Slowly turning from the cradle to the grave. Little children learn to look a way solid as stone, little as bone. Cause he knows he's been in the red Twenty-five dollars in the shoebox Next to the shotgun under his bed It went as planned Except for one man Who came in through the exit instead It went as planned Except for one man Who got a bullet in the back of his head Oh, lies turn true And wrong's no different than right The air turns heavy like words On a Saturday night Just how long will the light stay on when the dark is all that we know? It's all that we know. It's all we ever know. The main event radio show, Jason Spooner Band, All That We Know. Before that, it was Lady Lamb with Heretic, and from Shirt Tail Kin, a band from down east Maine, Road to Texas. Make em in Spain got us started, featuring Dave Mallet and his Ballad of St. Anne's Reel. All that and more coming your way with this in every edition of the main event, so stick around if you can. It's always good to have your company. We're here on your radio, and we're on Facebook. You can catch this and any other recent edition of the program YouTube audio files posted on our Main Event Radio Show page on Facebook. Also, meradio.org on the web. Go to the Listen Now button when you get to our website. You'll hear the latest edition of the show right in your very ears with one click. No matter how you do it, it's always good to have your company. Continuing now with the entertainment variety you've come to love is Norbert Twitchell with a story of how Cousin Philip didn't quite get it, but might in the future. Norbert Twitchell on the Main Event. The last, the last story I'd like to share with you was told to me by a friend who has since passed on, a man by the name of John Dennison, Jack Dennison, class of 1950 up here at Orno. When he retired, he was the dean of the Stockbridge School of Agriculture down at Amherst, down at the University of Massachusetts, a learned gentleman. But he far preferred to tell stories about growing up on the farm in Harrison, Maine. And one of his favorite stories was about his younger brother, Philip. Now, Philip weren't too smart. He'd been to Bridgeton Academy for six years. And when they turned him out, they gave him a certificate that says, your warm body's been here. But old Mr. Dennison, he wanted Phil to come up to Orno here just like his big brother Jack. So he said, Philip, he says, I've hired a tutor. He says, for the next two months, he says, we're going to tutor you, and you're going up to Orno in August, and you're going to take the entrance exam. So for two months, they stuffed every crevice in that boy's body full of knowledge. They bought him a new suit and a round-trip ticket, and he come up or no, take the entrance exam. Two days later, he come back, he got off the bus, and he's all rumpled and frazzled, looked like he'd been drugged through a keg of nails. How'd you do, Phil? He says, golly, Dad. He says, there was 150 questions on the test. He said, 149, I got most of them. He said, but the 150th was what's what? He says, I don't know what's what. Two weeks later, his rejection notice came. Mr. Dennison was not pleased, but he said, boy, he says, I know you worked hard. He says, I've talked to the tutor. He's going to live here all this year. He says, you're going back up there next August. Weekends, nights, holidays, you name it. They, algebra, geometry, Latin, French, anything in the known world was stuffed into that boy's body. Following August, they had to buy him a new suit because he'd grown three inches and added 45 pounds. They put him on the bus and they sent him back up here to Arno. Two days later, he come back, all tattered and torn. How'd you do, boy? He says, golly, Dad. He said, 150 questions. 149, I smacked them cold. 150th was what's what? He says, I do not know what's what. Two weeks later, his rejection notice came. Well, Mr. Dennison was not pleased. You ain't ever going to amount to nothing. He said, he's back. He says, Philip, he says, you've got to be disappointed as I am. He says, I know you're frustrated. He says, get your girlfriend the canoe. 
take it down the lake. He says, paddle out your frustrations. He says, you'll be out of my sight. So Phil got the 18-foot old town, you know, and got his girlfriend. He went down the lake. And they're paddling up and down the lake. He's doing the J-stroke, you know. He's got a rooster tail right out and back. He's going so fast. And his girlfriend, lovely girl, but the kindest thing I could say about her physique, uh, she was Rubenesque. <laughs> it was a rather warm, late August, steamy day, and all she had on was the tiniest of halters and shorts. And she's lounging up in there in the bow, you know, going on. And she got so warm that she reached into her pocket and she took out a hanky. And she leaned over the gunnel canoe and dapped it in the water so she could mop her fevered brow. Well, when she did, the halter busted and everything come right out. Now, Philip's a shy boy and had not been exposed to worldly pleasures. <laughs> and without even thinking, he said, golly, he says, what's that? And she said, what's what? He said, damn it, if I knew it, I'd be a junior at the University of Maine. <laughs> Not just another pretty radio show. This is the main event radio show. A few years back, the band got a government grant for $2.6 million to study the indigenous music of the state of Maine. After we spent just about all of it on beer, we piled into a 72 Plymouth and went up the highway to a place they call the county. It's way up there at the top of the state and about all they got is spuds up there. You can tell it's potato country. Even the teenagers, instead of getting pimples, have little eyes grow on their faces on Saturday nights. Their favorite saying is, this spuds for you. They even begin to take the shape of potatoes after a few years of working in the fields. But you know, we hit a musical bonanza when we was there. We understand that they had imported some workers from the islands to work in places like Island Falls and Presque Island, and the music had spread all around the county. So, one evening, we were standing at the edge of a spud field, and we could see these people who were outstanding in their field. And you could hear this sound, sort of wafting across the potato field. It went. When we got a little closer, we discovered they were singing a little ditty to make the work go lighter. The song went something but, but not, not exactly. exactly like this. Hey yo, hey yo, I said hey yo. Getting back and I wanna go home. Hey yo, 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 Getting back and I wanna go home. Come, Mr. Digger, man, and count up my potatoes. Get in back and I want to go home. Come, Mr. Digger, man, and count up my potatoes. Get in back and I want to go home. One potato, two potato, three potato, four. Get in back and I want to go home. Five potato, six potato, seven potato, more. Get in back and I want to go home. Hey, uh, hey, uh, I said, hey, uh, get in back and I want to go home. Hey, uh, hey, uh, today, uh, hey, 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 uh, Get in back and I want to go home All the wallpaper is made out of spud peels Get in back and I want to go home Baked stuff, french fried, boiled up and mashed Get in back and I want to go home All rotten, all rotten, scallop for hash Get in back and I want to go home Hey-ya, hey-ya, I said hey-ya Get in dark and I wanna go home Hey-ya, hey-ya, I said hey-ya, hey-ya, hey-ya It was all about My 
the youngest to the oldest, everyone helped out. Just a quiet little town in the Winston County, where I grew up and went to school, went to church on Sunday. We picked potatoes every fall. Joyce Rossi Gammon, winding up a, a brief set of agricultural songs, both about that northern Maine product we know so well, the potato. Growing up on a tater farm in Maine, from Joyce, in a wicked good band with, yeah, the potato picking song. And that followed the story of Philip's education from Norbert Twitchell. A bit of everything, a whole lot of really good stuff. That's what you get each and every time with the Main Event Radio Show. Because we like doing it. Hope you do too. Let's continue now. Here's The Coming Grass, and it's called Working Stiff. I think most of us can relate to that. The Main Event. It's 
Like a thief, and it changes colors like a maple leaf. You do your best to stop her, cause you don't wanna see it fall. But you're losing your grip, and you're losing sleep. Your boots in the mud, and they're sinking deep. And you gotta make a choice, man. You gotta make a call. So you miss a headshot, just take it in the chest. You love one girl, and you hurt the rest. A thousand miles left, I think you better go it alone. At the gate, and there's bodies in the street, and there's blood on your hands, and there's blood on your feet. But you keep on walking with your face looking like a stone. And don't let the black dog get you, and don't let your eyes get wet, and don't hang out if you want to leave town. And don't let the wolves come in when late night you're alone again, and don't let the bastards get you down.
dress in black She was into your skin But she was sipping a bottle of tank of rage gin In a pickup truck on an old back road On a cold fall night It's the same sad story you know too well Shot, you take it in the chest You lose one girl and you hurt the rest A thousand miles left Looks like you're gonna go it alone With the wolves at the gate And the bodies in the street And the blood on your hands And the blood on your feet you Keep on walking with your face Looking like a stone Don't let the black dog get you Don't let your eyes get wet And don't hang out if you want to leave town Wolves come in When late night you're alone again Don't let the bastards get you down Brothers Band on the main event with, well, don't let the, let's see, I don't know if I can say that on the radio. I'll give it to you in Latin. Illegitimi non cabarundum est. Don't let them get you down. Time now for a visit to the Vault of Vinyl. The Vault is where we keep our dusty, scratchy old record collection. Yes, records. And when we visit the Vault, we pull one out of the Vault and play a song from it for you. And uh, this time around, it's Schooner Fair with one of their classic albums from the you know, mid-70s and a great seagoing tale. Barrett's Privateers, as we visit the vault of vinyl on the main event. Oh, the year was 1778. How I wish I was in Sherbrooke now. A letter of mark came from the king to the scummiest vessel I've ever seen. God damn them all. I was told we'd cruise the seas for American gold. we fire no guns, shed no tears. Now I'm a broken man on a Halifax pier, the last of Barrett's privateers. Oh, Elsid Barrett cried to town, How I wish I was in Sherbrooke now. For twenty brave men, all fishermen, Who would make for him the antelope's crew? God damn them all! I was told we'd cruise the seas for American gold, We'd fire no guns, shed no tears. Now I'm a broken man on a Halifax pier, the last of Barrett's privateers. Now the antelope sloop was a sickening sight, how I wish I was in Sherbrooke now. She'd a list to port in her sails in rags, and the cook in the scuppers with the staggers and jags. God damn them all. I was told we'd cruise the seas for American gold, we'd fire no guns. Shed no tears, now I'm a broken man on a Halifax pier, the last of Barrett's privateers. 
On the king's birthday we put to sea How I wish I was in Sherbrooke now We were 91 days to Montego Bay Pumping like madmen all the way But damn them all I was told we'd cruise the seas For American gold We'd fire no guns Shed no tears Now I'm a broken man on a Halifax pier The last of Barrett's privateers On the 96th day we sailed again How I wish I was in Sherbrooke now When a bloody great Yankee hove in sight With our cracked four-pounders we made to fight God damn them all I was told we'd cruise the seas For American gold we'd fire no guns Shed no tears Now I'm a broken man on a Halifax pier The last of Barrett's privateers Now the Yankee lay low down with gold How I wish I was in Sherbrooke now She was broad and fat and loose in stage But to catch her took the antelope to old days God damn them all I was told we'd cruise the seas For American gold with fire no guns Shed no tears Now I'm a broken man on a Halifax pier The last of Barrett's privateers Now at length we stood two cables away How I wish I was in Sherbrooke now Our cracked four-pounders made an awful din But with one fat ball the Yanks stove us in God damn them all I was told we'd cruise the seas For American gold with fire no guns Shed no tears Now I'm a broken man on a Halifax pier The last of Paris privateers Now the antelope shook and pitched on her side How I wish I was in Sherbrooke now Barrett was smashed like a bowl of eggs And the main truck carried off both my legs God damn them all I was told we'd cruise the seas For American gold with fire no guns Shed no tears Now I'm a broken man on a Halifax pier The last of Barrett's privateers Now here I lay in my 23rd year How I wish I was in Sherbrooke now It's been six long years since we sailed away And I just made Halifax yesterday God damn them all I was told we'd cruise the seas For American gold with fire no guns Shed no tears Now I'm a broken man on a Halifax pier the last of Barrett's Privateers. Thank you very much. In this life, I know. You're either a mountain, a river, or a stone In this life unknown You're either a mountain, a river, or a stone In this life unknown You're either a mountain, a river, or a stone in this life unknown You're either a mountain, a river, or a stone And that river will flow free And that mountain will forever be And that stone's gonna roll Yes, that stone's gonna roll down the mountain, to the river, to the sea. In this life unknown, you're either a mountain, a river, or a stone. In this life unknown, you're either a mountain, a river, or a stone. 
Took big change and string Untie what surrounds me Every little thing Every little thing Late September Early sunbeam shows Me where to go To its own, I stroll into this story down this rusty road, and the front porch feels like home. Late September, early sunbeam greets my sleepy soul. Ooh, climb up. A spruce top, take a bird's eye view, see my world unfolding, watching what I do, finding what is true. It's like home, looking all around from above, holding on tight so I won't fall out of my tree. If I could. I wouldn't want to fly away Magic of this morning inviting me to stay Blackbird in a blue sky Murderer flies so free Silhouetting patterns Sweetly reminds me So grateful just to be If I could I wouldn't want to fly away Magic of this morning inviting me to empty all my pockets Toothpick, change and string Undie what surrounds me Every little thing Every little thing Feels like home. Thank you. That's Archipelago on the main event radio show, Front Porch. Archipelago is another band from down east Maine, Stonington area. Friend of the show and lobsterman Frank Gottwalls, a member and organizer of that band. Nice stuff from Archipelago. That's from a live band recorded in Stonington at the Opera House. Golden Oak gave us To the Sea. And speaking of going to the sea, it was Schooner Fair. It was we visited the Vault of Vinyl. And Barrett's Privateers. Arr. Let's move along now with the ghost of Paul Revere. And this is Wolves, the main event. i 
let your wolves inside my door. Real radio for real people just like you. That's the Main Event Radio Show. Now 
When I went down to the river The water was deep and cold It chilled his old body But it sure felt good to my When Jesus went down to the river And John baptized him there It was pleasing to his father When his spirit filled him on the main event, Banks of Jordan, a gospel number, a bit of a rockin' version of Tumbling Bones, who in fact were a group of choir boys. They started their own folk rock band. There you go. Experience in every area counts, doesn't it? We heard Memphis Lightning, too, with Crazy Man Blues, and that brings us to time to put a wrap on this edition of the original Homegrown Radio Show, the main event, with thanks to the station for putting us on the air, and thanks to Kevin Foley for getting the IT work done that I don't have a clue about. And thanks especially to you for joining me. I hope you're going to be here next time. I know I will. When the main event comes your way once again. Till then, Dan Foley signing off for the main event. A Holy Mackerel production coming to you from the cultural center of the known universe in Kennebec County. Be good to yourself. Be good to the folks you meet. And let's all be good to the planet. It's the only one we got. Thank <laughs> you.